we all love life hacks. They're like, they're like the big craze on the internet and have been for a while. These little cheats that can, you know, change your life forever. You can look at things a different way and think, oh my God, that's amazing. That's totally changed my life. And they're really popular on YouTube. They're an entire channel set up. They're on Instagram. They're all over the place. But some of them are a little bit of a reach. I'm just saying. And this is my list of top five most pointless life hacks I have ever seen. Let's get straight into it. So if you're new here or if you're not new here and you like this sort of content, hit that subscribe button, hit that alarm bell and you'll be kept up to date of all the stuff that's going on on my channel. Now then, let's get into these life hacks. Some are insane. Let's take a look at five of the most pointless life hacks I have ever seen. Number five in the most pointless life hacks I have ever seen. Watch this. Uh, some toothpaste. And we put the toothpaste into a cup. Add water. That seems important. Stir into a foam. We'll get a syringe because we all have syringes. S put the toothpaste and water back into the toothpaste. Oh, okay, a, a spray bottle top, because we all have those laying on, and some hot glue. This is a mess. Nice funky music. Then we attach the spray to the toothpaste. Um, and then we spray it on Genesis TV's logo. He's the guy who did this life hack. Spray it. And it's useless, it seems. It just... Wow, that's not even very good. So I don't know about you, but I'm... So you take a bottle of toothpaste, which is quite expensive, and then a, make a cheap cleaning product with it that isn't particularly good or as good as cleaning products. And with a hot glue gun and a spray bottle. So presumably you've already bought a bottle of cleaning thing. You take that off the bottle of cleaning thing. Put it into the toothpick. Uh, number four on the most useless life hacks ever. Oh, this is a boot. DIY watermelon juice. So first of all, you take a big watermelon, it seems. All right. I'm already thinking I just want to buy a carton of watermelon juice for a pound. I don't know how much a full watermelon is. It's probably more than a pound. Take a really sharp knife. Don't kill yourself or stab yourself. Cut out the water. Get some copper pipe, because yeah, we've all got that lying around, right? Insert the copper pipe into the watermelon. This is genius right here. Okay, so you've got a nice hole in the watermelon. I get a tap. I know, I, yeah, because i got loads of those just lying around, just cluttering up the kitchen. Screw the tap into the watermelon. Okay, I can see where we're going. Seriously? Oh. You get a power, power drill and a paint mixer attachment. <laughs> then make a massive mess. Blend the inside of your watermelon. Wow. That's hygienic. Hopefully you don't get Dulux on your watermelon juice. Put the top back. Oh, balance the watermelon precariously on a handy pint glass. And presumably dispense. Love the little slow panning effects there, because you know, show off the artistry, right? <laughs> How much effort is that? You can just buy, you can just buy a carton of watermelon juice for a pound or a dollar. Or you can like buy a tap, which is about seven dollars. And a copper pipe and a power drill. Is this for real? I don't think so. Uh, number three on the most useless life hacks I've ever seen. This is a life hack to... So again with the toothpaste, this guy's obsessed with toothpaste hacks. Get a plastic bag, right? He doesn't say what he's trying, what, what, what life hack he's trying to save. Get some money, okay? And a battery. 
Okay, so we've got a battery and some money. Putting the money in the plastic bag. I bet that's going back. Yep, yeah, they put that back in the toothpaste. So is that to save it from villains? That's not going to be easy to spend, is it? Oh, a stealth. Hidden. Oh, no, no, no. Of course, you throw it over a wall. And then open it with a sharp knife that you're bound to have laying around. And get your bag of money and battery and toothpaste. Is that for prisoners? Is that an illegal life hack? Or is it just a handy way to throw money over a wall? In a toothpaste tube. Halfway through, <laughs> these despairing life hacks. Number two is just, this is insane. This is the most insane thing I've ever seen. I don't know who this is aimed at here. Got a large bottle of drink, like a two litre bottle or something. Three drinking straws. Carefully open the bottle. Cut out the lid. The sharp knife, and careful not to injure yourself. Insert the one straw into the bottle top. Only to the top of the fluid, I see. Okay, so you've got a straw in a bottle. I'll show what the cap is for. Ah, this is an elastic band. This is really elaborate and kind of pointless. Uh, I make it look like a, like a siphon. <laughs> What's the point to this? Why can't you just pour the bottle? Why do you need to attach three drinking straws together and then pour a piss <laughs> And this is this is amazing. This is my favourite of all. <laughs> this is so daft. I mean, look, I can't really argue. I'm saying people are desperate for views. I'm kind of using these because I'm desperate for views. Yeah, that's that's. <laughs> these are just too funny. Okay, here we go. Serious now. <laughs> no, not serious. And I'm laughing. So I'm talking funny. Here we go. Here we go. This is genius. This is genius. Why the manufacturers? Look. Right, so again with the toothpaste. Right, so you take off the toothpaste dispenser. Take a very sharp looking box. Oh God, don't cut your hands, dude. Take a box cutter to the top of the toothpaste tube. Cut off the, the, the screw thread into the very thick toothpaste. Ah, oh, insert, <laughs> insert the much smaller and vacuum dispenser. These are not going to work, man. And then hot glue the dispenser back into your toothpaste tube. What happens when it rolls up? So you've got hot glue. He loves the hot glue, this guy. And here we go. Here we go. Here's the money shot. Get ready. This is going to be awesome. Watch this. Watch how the toothpaste flows out in a... <laughs> It's a pathetic dribble. What was that for? How was that helping anyone ever? I mean, see, look, toothpaste comes with a nozzle, which quite, I, I mean, unless, you, unless you're like an elephant or somebody, even if you don't have an opposing digit, okay, like you're a cat, even if you had, if, even if you were a cat, you would have some control over the toothpaste dispensation volume. That doesn't help. That makes how to take a thing and then elaborately make it worse. Why? This, this is, <laughs> this is why we can't have nice things. This is why the world is the way it is. Because of these mad people. I'm gonna do some weird, I'm gonna, I feel like I should do my own life hacks. So thank you for watching. Thank you for putting up my stupid voice because I can't talk funny. Uh, <laughs> I know I just sneezed snot out of my nose. Gross. Thank you for putting up. Oh my god. Thank you for putting up with my with my stupid voice. Thank you for watching these ridiculous life hacks. Links to the originals are below. Comment, like, subscribe, share, dislike, 
all the good stuff and I will see you all in the very next video when I hopefully haven't got a sore throat anymore. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys. Bye. It was so silly. I'm going to bed now. If you're new here or if you're not new here, new, blah, blah, blah. if you're new here or if you're not here, oh, f if you're new here or if you're not new here, oh, why am I doing a dance?